Hello everyone! In this video, we will see how to add a countdown timer in CapCut. So let's get into it. First of all, let's navigate to CapCut on your computer and open it. As you can see, I have already opened it on my computer screen. Let's start by creating a new project. Once you are in the CapCut video editor, let's go to the Media tab and click on Import. Select a video from your PC and then click Open. Once the video is imported into the Media tab, drag it onto the track at the bottom of the screen. Now, let's start adding the countdown timer process. From the top left sidebar, open the Text tab and drag the default text box onto a new track. Let me zoom in on the tracks for better visuals. Set the Text tab duration to about 1 second by stretching from one side. From the top right side, replace the text with the digits 10. Now, let's navigate to the Stickers tab from the top left menu and scroll down to find the countdown sticker. Once you find it, drag it onto a new track under the text box. First of all, set the sticker duration to 1 second and remove the rest. To make changes to the sticker, right-click on it and then select Create Compound Clip. Now, from the top right side in the Video tab, open the Mask and select the Circle tool. Revert the Mask tool with the help of the little icon. Now, adjust its size in the Preview tab by stretching from the corners. Select the text box and from the top right, change the font style and adjust its size by adding a specific value. Adjust the text position correctly in the Video Preview tab. Then scroll down in the Video Basic tab, and in the Blend mode, change the text opacity according to your needs. Now let's go to the Animation tab, and scroll down to the last to find the Mini Zoom animation. Once you find it, click on it to apply it to the selected text box. Now, let's start working to make the countdown timer. Make a copy by selecting both files or duplicate it by pressing Alt key and dragging the selected file. In this way, Make 10 copies. Now, change the digit values in the text box. The first one is OK with 10 digits, so let's start with the second. Select the text box one by one, and from the top right side, change the digits accordingly. After these changes, select all text boxes plus stickers and right-click on them. From this menu, select Group. Now, all these files are converted into a group, and from the top right side, change the scale value to resize it. Change its position by adding x-axis and y-axis values. Once everything is done, let's have a preview. And that's it! This is how you can add a countdown timer in CapCut. If you found this video useful, please show your support with a like. Your feedback is invaluable to us, so feel free to share your thoughts and suggestions in the comments section below. We're eager to hear from you.